Hello YouTube, I'm going to make a video about downgrading and upgrading on the Bold 2 or Blackberry Bold 9700. Um, you're going to go ahead and need your Blackberry Bold, whichever, whatever color you guys have. And then you're going to, you're going to need the data cable, just USB. Okay, first you're going to go ahead and plug it in. You're also going to need something called Blackberry Desktop Manager. And you can get it by just Googling it. And it'll pop up. And you just go ahead and set the download. I'll see if I can put a link of that inside the thing. Inside the video. Okay, as soon as I start it up, it's going to run this. It's saying checking device application for updates. Okay, it's going to say it has a 6.0, which is the newest firmware for the BlackBerry 9700. But right now, I'm running a 5.0, and I like the 5.0, so I'm going to leave it like that because it's more user-friendly. Well, like, for me, I prefer that because I, ever since I've had a BlackBerry, I've just been running off 5.0 all the time. So I'm going to go ahead and cancel. But for those who want to go to 6.0, you can just automatically do that if you're lower. But for the people that want to go back from a 6.0 down to a 5.0, it doesn't give you that option through there. So you have to go through a different route. I'm going to teach you how to do that. Okay, you're going to go ahead and you have to have your device set up, clicked. Okay, over here you're going to get this prompt and it's going to say, this is on the actual BlackBerry. You're going to get the prompt, do you want to turn on massive storage mode? And then you just press yes. It says some other stuff, but that doesn't matter. Just press yes and you can exit from your clock or you can have it like that. Okay, then after that, you go ahead and make sure that it's plugged in. It's going to recognize your device down here at the bottom. Now I'm going to, okay, there you go. It's a BlackBerry 9700. I'm covering my pin, so you, well, yeah, but, but yeah, okay. Then right here, you're going to see, okay, there's going to be like six different icons that you can select from. It's going to be media, device, search, wizard, mm, synchronize, application loader, backup and restore, and IP mode. M modem, I'm sorry. And then um, you're going to have to go ahead and push right here on application loader because it says update, add, or remove device applications. Okay, that's going to be what you need because you need to update, right? Okay, now here it's going to bring up these two things. It's going to be add and remove applications and update software, okay? You're going to go ahead and go to update software. Even though you do want to downgrade, it says update, but yeah, you can still downgrade from here. You go and you click start, right? Okay, right now it's just running that. This is the original setup. It's going to say one of three, but if you go down and you press show details, it'll tell you exactly what it's doing. Okay, and it gives you its time about how long it's going to take. Okay, look, it brought me to this screen, and this screen, it's already ready to downgrade. Let's say you were at a 6.0 preferred. It says preferred because that's what's, like, what's original on the 9700, what it comes with, I guess. But, I mean, it's not as user-friendly, so I prefer the 5.0. Right now, I'm at a 5.0, which it says current, but there are different versions. Like, there's the 7 point, or the... 0.714 and then the 0.586 and the 0 0.330 okay right now I'm running the 0 0.714 okay I think they they run pretty much the same I've never used the, the other ones I've been using this one but it runs fine on my Blackberry and I do it because uh, I I get to like uh, install a bunch of themes because there's a bunch of free themes for the 5.0 anyway Sometimes you may not get this this uh, prompt right here where you can just downgrade. If it happens that you don't get the prompt, then you're going to get another prompt that says you must uh, update your BlackBerry something. I don't know exactly what it says. And then just go ahead and click yes, and then it's going to give you another prompt. It's going to it's going to be like a little alert, and it's going to say um, uh, you need to close whatever's in behind, right? Which being the BlackBerry Desktop Manager. So you just click OK and it'll automatically co close for you and it'll take you back to the main menu which it is right here. It's going to take you back to the main menu and then you just go ahead and go back over here to the application loader because you had already done that but it's going to do that 
because it didn't take you into that automatically. I had already done that on my laptop, that's the reason that it didn't give me that prompt. But anyway, you go into update software, right? And then it's going to give you this again, it's going to load it up, it takes a little while, maybe like, I don't know, 30 seconds, it doesn't take too long. Okay, once it loads, it's going to have the versions right here. After it has that version, you just go ahead and click the version you want, and you push next. Let's say mine is right here. And I'm not going to downgrade or upgrade, I'm just going to click right here. You click next. Okay, and it starts to do the update or downgrade, whichever one you chose. It's, uh, on mine it says no software update is required for your device because I already have that software update but if I would have ch selected the uh, 6.0 or to downgrade to a lower version of mine it would have done it but that's pretty much it I mean that's all you need to do so you need Blackberry data cable and Blackberry desktop manager and I'll try and put that in the link in the bottom I'll try and put a link of uh, the BlackBerry Desktop Manager where you can download it for the Bold 9700. And uh, thank you for watching, and bye.